Hello and welcome to another how-to series by Someco. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create an organizational chart in Excel from scratch. After watching the whole video, you're going to be able to create your own org chart in Excel. There are five different ways to create an org chart. We can use Excel shapes, smart art graphics, add-ins, format in cells, and also we can use Excel templates. Before we start, I'd like to adjust the column width to 2.14, so we can work a bit more easily. Let's start with the first method, Excel shapes. Let's add multiple shapes so we can create an org chart. Adding shapes is really easy. Just click on insert, shapes, then we can select the shapes available here. After placing the shapes, we can add names and the titles on the shapes by clicking on them. Lastly, we can place lines to link the boxes to each other. Let's go insert then shapes again. Then we can select the lines. We can also change the shape style here. We can also turn on snap to grid so we can place the boxes more accurately. We can also align the boxes for better look. You can add new shapes each time you need another box. We can also customize the shapes by changing its color. And lastly, we can get rid of the grid lines for a better look. And that's how we create an org chart using the Excel shapes. Let's continue with the second method, Smart Art Graphics. Smart Art is an exceptional feature that comes with Microsoft Office programs and helps you to build simple graphics. It's really simple to create org chart using Smart Art. All we have to do is to click on insert, then smart art, then we choose the hierarchy one, and we can choose one of the graphics available here. Let's choose this one. We can also add additional shapes by clicking the add shape button under the smart design section. Let's enter some text on each shape. Now we can customize the chart. Just click on Smart Art Design and you can change the color. And you can even change the design of the chart. You can still change the layout for your liking. Let's continue with add-ins. Add-ins are extensions. They add additional features to Microsoft Office. In this video, I'll be using the VCO Data Visualizer add-in. If you don't have the VCO add-in, just click on Insert, then Get Add-ins, type VCO, then you can click Add to Microsoft VCO Data Visualizer. Once you add the extension, it will appear on the Add-in section under Insert tab here. Let's click on VCO to get started. Let's click on the Organization Chart section. Now we can select the layouts available here. Let's choose the vertical one. It comes with the diagram itself and the data table that is consists of employee IDs, name, title, manager ID, and role type. You can add or remove as many rows you like. The data table comes with dummy data, and the changes you made on the table will reflect the chart after click the refresh button here. Let's add another employee on the chart. Let's give a title to the new employee. We have to type the manager ID here, so our new employee can be shown in the chart in correct order. 
Let's select the roll type. Now let's hit the refresh button. As you can see, the chart updated itself with the new data. Please note that using Visio charts requires Visio license, which is a separate purchase from Office 365. Let's continue with the fourth method, formatting cells. We can use cells to generate an organization chart by modifying the color and width of their borders. It's actually really easy to modify cell borders. Let's just select cells, right click, and let's click format cells. Now we can create borders here. We can also choose the border color. Let's create a couple of more shapes. Let's create border lines to connect the boxes. Let's add some text on the boxes. If you think the names and titles could be too long for one cell, you can either adjust the length of the cell or merge two cells together. Just select the cells in the box and click merge and center. Now we can enter your data. We can also align the text here. Now the chart is ready to present. Let's continue with the fifth method, Excel templates. These are ready to use Excel templates made by experts and can be downloaded from outside sources. If you don't have time to create an org chart in Excel or simply want more detailed, professional looking org chart available, you can download it online. Just go to Somica's website Search for org chart, select org chart generator, and you can download this template for free by clicking the download button. Thanks for watching.